Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm from tipsforpc.com. Um, it's just a computer tips website. Now what I want to show you today is how to install PNG Crush. Now this is a an open source program that crushes your PNG images for your website. So if I just go into a post, um, go down like an image like this uh, PNG crush will crush it to optimize it for your website before you upload it now the reason I s wanted to use this is because I'm actually having a problem with the smush it plugin for WordPress okay so and also the less plugins the better so I'm going to show you how I'm going to smush I mean well smush or crush my PNG images before uploading them but first I need to install this program because it's not that easy now what I'm going to do is have a link to download the PNG crush and the files that you're going to need with it um, because what happened is I searched around the internet and I had no idea how to use it and I found this page here freemancontingent.ie and it had a page on PNG crush okay here and it had a download there now there was a couple of little problems with the tutorial but this is basically how I worked out this whole thing okay but this is still not for the beginner computer like person because it's ju just got these little difficult things that you probably wouldn't understand so I have uh, made a video and a full tutorial on how to install PNG crush and also then how to use it okay so what we're gonna do is um, I just want to show you something which is uh, I'm just gonna get rid of that now this file that you see in the background here this is the PNG crush um, help file <laughs> and I like I nearly died when I saw it okay I thought oh my god no way am I going to be able to have time to work this out so I thought that that is out the door forget about that so let's get rid of that because that's pretty scary okay so what I did is I downloaded the file from that website that I showed you now I am editing that myself because there was a couple of little things that didn't work for me so what happens is I downloaded the zip file and there it is there if you can just see that PNG crush dot zip and then I right clicked on it and uh, pressed on extract all okay so then I had the PNG crush file there now at the moment I have installed it in directly into the local C disk now how I got there was I went to start menu then I went to computer then I double clicked on C now that's how I got there now this is also called the root okay the, this is the root and this is also where Windows is installed so you're going to need administrative access or permissions to actually paste a file in here okay well you should do otherwise you've got very bad security on your computer alright so we've got the file there what we wanted just okay, so I'm going to open it up now the problem here is that it has PNG crush folder in here again so we've got to click on that and here's the contents now the first problem is that it's got PNG crush folder PNG crush and we only want um, one folder straight in the C drive okay now these are shortcuts so what we have to do is copy these two shortcuts and paste them into the send to menu now you know that send to menu when you when you right click on something and it says send to now see how I've got those two things there 
So this is what I am going to show you how to do. So we're going to go down to the start menu and hopefully you've got Windows 7 or something and um, we're going to type in shell colon send to all one word see that there and this is what comes up here so press on it and it'll take you to the send to folder okay so now let's have a look so I've got the shortcuts in here I copied them so let's just move this across now here's where it originally came from so I just selected it and press down the control key on your keyboard to select both those they're both shortcuts as you can see right click and then we want to copy okay and then we go back to the other send to this is where we want to put it and we right click and we paste now I didn't copy it so there's no paste option because it's already there okay so paste it now what we want to do is check on I'm going to right click on it and check on the path of the shortcut okay so at the moment we've got um, a different path in there because I've actually changed it but um, just say we wanted to go just say we wanted to go um, in directly into C drive it would be C and I'm just going to take that away it would be C slash PNG crush slash um, EXE now if you've got the original file from that website okay it's going to have two PNG crushes here so it's going to look like this C PNG crush slash PNG crush slash PNG crush dot exe etc etc now these are the extra option commands and stuff like that now that is um, that's what you've got to check on where is that shortcut pointing to is it pointing to, all it's got to do is point to PNG crush dot exe now you need to see where you've stored it so let's just go over here so there it is there right that's where I've stored it on this computer if I click up here it actually gives me the path okay there it is there okay so that is the key you need to paste those two into the send to folder and make sure that the paths are coming back here so I'll show you one more time here let's go back properties okay now I have edited that there but my true true uh, path is here okay so I'll show you because I have actually installed that entire folder in my user profile which is user mits PNG crush okay now this is what it says down here as well so make sure that this and this part, first part are the same now this is the actual command one and this is where it's going to start in so make sure you've got them the same all right so let's go that's done okay we'll just double check it to make sure I didn't muck anything up yep and close it okay so we have the correct shortcuts in the send to menu okay I'm going to close it and there's that there I'm going to close it right close it okay so here is some images that I have okay now firstly I'm going to right click on one okay right click on it and I'm going to go send to PNG crush and it's going to come up with this and I'm going to press run okay that was quick did you see it okay now what it's done here it is here right next to it it's put number two in the name of it okay so what I want to do is mouse over and see that this one is 54.4 kilobytes and the new one is 51.3 
Now the reason for that, it's not much difference, is because I already resized it before I uploaded it. Now this has crushed what it can out of it and this one is the image that we need to upload. Now let's see if we can select, if, if I hold down the control key on the keyboard and select four of them at once and go to send to and we're going to go PNG crush and press run. Okay, so it's doing the four separate images and there they are popped up. Now it's very quick as well, which is quite amazing. Um, now the thing is, I can go along and delete those images now and I've got these ones ready to go and optimized for the internet. So basically these images are useless um, to me and I can just right click on them and delete them and press yes and there's the new images um, ready to go alright uh, I hope that helps you install PNG crush and then use it now the main thing is to get that path right for that shortcut because you've got to point it to the exe file alright thanks for watching